What's up, everybody? This week on the T3T, Anastasia makes Hi. her return, and we'll be talking about sure. the winter schedule, masks, and the memorial names in the worship guide. All that's coming up right now. Well, look at you, Miss Anastasia. You're on the T3T. Hi. <laughs> so who inspired you? Was it was it Darla Cedarberg and, and Father Todd doing it or what? No, Christian just said, we should do this. <laughs> well, I think it was Father Todd. Father Todd said we what? should do this. Okay, well, hey, Father Todd didn't tell me. You said Father Todd said, mm -hmm. so I'm assuming Father Todd did say we should do it. So I said, sure, why not? I think the biggest question I always get from everyone, they want to know, how are you feeling? I'm feeling great, except hard to walk, but I'm feeling great. <laughs> we are gonna bring to you the top three things that you need to know this week at St. Mary's. The first thing is, Happy Easter! Hallelujah! <laughs> now going into Easter week, and so honey, you know, usually at St. Mary's, the uh, after Easter, you know, we start to see some of the snowbirds go back to their home states. Schedule usually doesn't change too much later on. So what is this, this first thing we got to know about that's really important for people to know? The first thing we have to know about is starting this week, the services schedule has been changed into the summer schedule. So there will be a service at 5 p.m. on Saturday, and there will be the 7.30 a.m. service there will be the 9 a.m. service at the CFW, and there will be 10.30 service, traditional service. So the 9 a.m. traditional service has been moved to 10.30. So if you've already been going to the church, you know the summer schedule is different. So this is the schedule that we will be following starting this coming week. And you're more of a 7.30 a.m. service kind of person. I love 7.30, folks. No, I am 9 a.m. service because I like to slip in. <laughs> what one of the most uh, surprisingly well-attended services online has been? 7.30. The 7.30. It's been amazing. I think we, we kind of, uh, <laughs> in this new world of online servicing. Uh, and I think people sleep early, so they also wake up early, a little earlier, maybe. You now. think that's what it is? Yeah, because, you know, you're not doing much if you're <laughs> at home in this time of... <laughs> Corona, yeah. so people wake up early and they probably tune in while they get in their breakfast and stuff like that. And they're like, oh, look, a church. Yeah. Yeah. So the number two thing we need to let you know about is that uh, this last so this last weekend was Easter, obviously, and we always have the memorial name. So you can honor someone mm -hmm. and you can, uh, so their names will be put inside the worship bulletin. You might have looked in the worship bulletin and seen the name that you submitted and it wasn't in there. Uh, don't fret. Uh, so it's a two-week thing. So if the names came in past the deadline, they just go into the next week. So look at the worship bulletin coming up this week and for Easter one, and you will see your loved one's name in there. You'll see a complete list of all the folks that you can put in there. Number three. Number three. We have these masks. We have women, some women in the church who are making these masks and they are for free. If you need a mask, you, we all know, you know, it's good to wear the mask when you go out, when you go to the grocery stores, when you are um, taking a walk and you feel like there are a lot of people on the streets. These masks are, um, are being made by some of the women at the church as the Mary's. So if you need a mask, it's two per household. If you need a mask, please contact the church. Contact yeah. St. Mary's and we'll be able to give you a mask. Seven seven two two eight seven three two four four. I don't know why people wear masks like this. Like it goes over your nose. And it comes with a little bit of like a filter mm -hmm. in there, so you can put a filter inside. And, and, and it's and it's cloth, so it could be washed, it could be reused. So you take this out, and then you wash this, and you put this back in. Right now we have about thirty, mm -hmm. and there will be more orders coming in. But please contact St. Mary's, and we will. Um, Get your mask. And too. the word is that I think they need some of the elastic bands, these little um, quarter inch elastic bands to be making ones. more. So let us let us know if you have that so you can drop them off maybe at the church. Honey, 
you know, before we say goodbye to everyone, you know, I'm, I'm so, I mean, let me ask you, I'm so darn exhausted from just getting done with Easter weekend. And then she's been like not sleeping at all because this baby's going to come out at any second. So she gets like two hours of sleep. I haven't slept a lot lately and we haven't even had the baby yet. I'm so punch drunk tired. Uh, but we've been reading this thing. Uh, and listen, if you didn't read it during Lent, we're still quarantined, so you can just keep on reading this book. But you and I have been reading it, and we've yeah. really enjoyed it. It's no, been a great devotion great. for yeah, us. It's great. We like doing it. We do, you know, so they have the morning. We could do the morning one, and they also have the evening one as well. Um, so we do read this. And, you know, you quarantine, you want something to do, so why not just read this? Yes, just, the emotionally healthy spirituality. Is and pray, and sleep in, and cook, and, and if, eat healthy. And you, and, and wash your hands yes. and please, please practice the social distancing. If you go to Publix, make sure you wear your mask, wear your gloves, wash your hands. Listen, you did it. The T3T. Fire tight, I did it. The top three things I here for it. you at St. Mary's. God bless you. You all have an amazing, wonderful week. Yes. For Easter one, the Lord is risen. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord is risen indeed. Go walk alleluia. in the... Alleluia. Alleluia. Yay. You did it. Go Bye, peace. Go walk in the resurrection light.